Hi, so here's a relatively quick video. This is something that's kind of hidden in the the settings for uh, cycles. I wanted to kind of take my scene and just give it like a uniform color throughout. And there's a really slick way to do that in uh, cycles. You can do something similar in EV. But to me, it doesn't look as good as good. But it looks really slick in cycles, so I thought I'd show you how to do that. That's making like if you wanted to make a clay render, give everything a kind of a clay color. You can do that. So let me move to cycles. I'll show you how to do both in in cycles. Uh, this way works in EV as well if you go to mat cap for the objects and here you can select different ones you can make everything look like a shiny car make it look like a orange I guess but I'm gonna go over here so it's like a clay kind of render so if well you if you render the image I'm not gonna show up like this it's gonna show up how you have it rendered so the thing you need to do is go to this viewport render image and that's going to render what you see there in the viewport. And that's a way that you can get that kind of clay type render. But you know, it doesn't really look that great. Now there's a better way to do it. If you go to cycles and here, let me uh, revert everything back. So it's a, kind of a rendered view. So then here, if you go to the settings, if you uh, look for it, uh, you can see uh, override. And here is where you can override the material for your render. So if I switch over to this clay material that I made, boy, it's uh, everything looks like porcelain all of a sudden. If you want to make everything look kind of pinkish, of course, you can use this with the material library that comes as an add-on. You can see one of my other videos is, that describes that. There's a set of sample materials that comes with it. And you can see there's quite a few there. You can choose any of these and make them apply to everything. Let's, let's say we make a material and make it a lemon. Let's do that. Let's make a new material, apply to selected, so then we have a lemon material. And then if we go over to the override, let's change it to lemon. And now everything looks like it's lemon peel. <laughs> so let's take a look at that and see how that, see how that looks. It's going to look great. It's a little odd how the, uh, the hair materials kind of look a little strange, but everything else looks like uh, lemon, lemon peel. So that's something you can do. It kind of helps you sometimes to kind of sort out the, the lighting to, to see everything kind of within the kind of a clay color. So there you go. That is a quick little tip there. And if you like this kind of video, please click like or, or subscribe and uh, have a good one. I'll see you in the next one. Bye.